come round and see what food I can get off you. I'm not getting any food off you. No, well, that looks nice, actually, doesn't it? What's that? Uh, goat and oxtail. Goat as well? Yeah. Goat and oxtail? Yeah. You're mad. Have <laughs> <laughs> you got any pies? <laughs> oh, he's got a pie. A bit of crust. No, what about a minute? I've got just one. What have you got? Pizza. Oh, can I pizza? Yeah. Yeah, but for a second, you look a bit angry, you might not be out. <laughs> bit of pizza. So, of course, comic relief, you know, keep the uh, energy up. No chance of getting a bird off him. No. Right, what else can we do? Right, um, what we're going to do, we're going to have a little competition. And we've got some cracking prizes for you. Um, where's, where's it going, that kid? Oh, son, you alright? Is that your dad? Oh, I'm a uncle. Your uncle? Sit down a minute, you might win a prize. Come sit down. You don't know yet, you don't know yet. So anyway, just to explain what we're doing, I've been doing 20 gigs in, um, 20 gigs in a day to raise some money for uh, Comet Relief. And the idea is that we just have a bit of a crack now. Set the book each round, come and kiss you and give you a hug. And then we'll do a little bit of that. Is that alright? Yeah. We need to do a warm up though first. Can you just give, do a practice round of applause? One, two, three. <laughs> right, we've got. You alright, love? You alright? What's your name? This is Mrs. Graham, everybody. Give me a practice round of applause, please. Yeah. If she doesn't behave herself, I'm just going to wheel it out. <laughs> You getting past the coming here? Got a chance for your name, darling? Karen, there's Karen as well. Okay, right. I've got loads of kids. I've got loads of kids because we've married loads of times. Oh, okay. I know it's not my fault, it's their fault. Yeah. I've got Josh, there's Josh there, you've been swinging a bucket around in a bit. Where's Josh? He's got a red bucket, he's, Irene. he's gone. Irene. Irene. Oh, my French is here. Oh, she ain't that. Hello, Irene. You alright? <laughs> Hello, Irene, how are you doing? I'm good. Good? Yeah? Are you warm enough? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Bit, yeah. What's your name, kiddo? I don't know. This is Michael, right, okay. Michael, what it is, I've got loads of kids, but we need to do a warm up to make sure you're all just in the mood for a bit of comedy. Is that alright? Yeah. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to pretend, just bear with me, we're going to pretend that Scooby Doo is our boss. Okay, so I'm going to shout Scooby! You've all got to go. Hallelujah. Okay. Best one gets a prize. Here we go. One, two, three. Scooby. Bit rubbish. You were okay, Michael, but nobody else was doing it. Then, does anybody know sign language? Excuse me. You, can you sign for me to those people there, please? Can you sign? Tell them. Tell them. Tell them. You ready? I know that sign. I know that a round of applause in sign language is this. Okay, there's some people there that are uh, signing, so you know that. So what we've got is this thing for you, where, can you explain to them, yeah? Where I shout, I shout Scooby, and you go hallelujah, both hands in the air like that. Okay, so watch my lips, watch my lips, can you watch my lips, ready? You ready everybody? One, two, three, Scooby! Hallelujah! That's brilliant, right, the next bit, after you've done hallelujah, Turn to the person next to you, Michael, and you've got to go like this. <laughs> you ready? One, two, three, Scooby! Oh. What happened to the... <laughs> <laughs> so, the thing is, I've got loads of kids, that's what I was going to tell you about. I've got loads and loads of kids. I've got Josh, there, oh there's Josh there with a the bucket, he'll be coming out for donations. I've got Nicole, and I've got my little boy Oliver as well. Because I've started again, I thought I'd start again, have some more kids, you know, like you do. But when my daughter now, my daughter, she's 24 now. She, no, honestly, these scallies keep round knocking on for her. You know the proper scallies, you know the ones that are really rough with the bum fluff goes to bed. You know the ones that they walk into your house like this, alright, nice one. <laughs> They're doing that. So what I've done is, I do this really good Robert De Niro face. I can do a De Niro face, so what I do is, when they come to the door, they're knocking on, giving it, all right, Mr. Roberts, is she in? <laughs> I open the door, I look them right in the face, and you like this, do you know who Robert De Niro is? Yeah? Watch this. So you, you stand up, Michael, you're going to be the boyfriend. Stand on there. <laughs> so you're a scally that's come round my house trying to set my daughter out, okay? Yeah. 
Right. So you go, all right, Mr. Roberts, is he calling? Yeah. That's good. So you're at the door like that, I'm going to scare you. I'm going to turn into Robert De Niro. Watch this, you ready? Watch this. You're not going to believe this. You're not going to believe this. Love your heart, people. I think I'm going to have a wobbler, you know, because my belly starts at my bus. <laughs> no, honestly, I've been going to the doctors, I've been trying to go to Weight Watchers and everything. I went to Weight Watchers, I went to Weight Watchers and I got there. And I couldn't get in. And just as I was going to walk away, this big massive car turned up. And this big woman got out with a big kid. And you know when you make it, it was in a school hall. You know like they have a school hall at the back of the church. And I went up to this woman and I went, Weight Watchers? And she went, uh, no, play group. So anyway, he's the scally. I don't want to come round anymore, so I'm going to scare him with the Robert De Niro face. Are you ready? Don't get too scared, Michael. Okay, you ready? Oh, there's Jack Nicholson, he's walked in. You ready? Watch this now. You're knocking, knock at the door. Knock on the door. And I come to you and I go. <laughs> the thing is, I can't, do the, I can't do the voice, I can only do the face. It's not bad, the face. What's this? What's this? What's this now? It's basically going to be Nero. De Nero. Robert De Nero. Ready? You'll be impressed with this, watch. Is it ready? Ready? But I can't do the voice. The only voice I can do is Ashley of Coronation Street. So imagine this, right, Michael? You're the scally boy. He's the scally boy at my door, knocking off my daughter. I walk up to him and I mess it up big time. I've got him on the ropes, I'm doing my De Niro, so I'm like this. Joe Pesky's here in his wheelchair, there, like that. I walk up, he's on the ropes, he's really scared. And I went like this, I went. I'll sit back Uncle Fred. Not scared of that, is it? So we're going to have a competition now, we've got some good prizes. And we're going to pull some people out, and that guy there with the green cap on, he, he said he'll go first. Give him a big round of applause. Yeah. Come over here, big man. Over here, please. Sit down, Michael. You're going to judge. You're going to judge who the best in here is. Okay? So what we do is, what's your name, Pop? Alan. Alan. Over here, Alan. Alan's going to walk from here. He's going to walk up like this. And he's going to do his best in here face. And then give him a clap. Michael, you've got to choose who the best in hero is. We're going to do three all together. Okay? You ready, Alan? Yeah. Get into, get into the mode. Get to, hang on, hang on, hang on, don't give it away. <laughs> Take the cap off, it'll look more intimidating. I want that thing. That's even better, yeah. Watch this now. Alan, Alan does. Give me a round of applause as I say it. Alan does. Robert De Niro. <laughs> hang on, hang on. Go. Get to the table, pull the face, Alan, pull the face. <laughs> he actually looks like he's having a poo. Yeah. Let's give Alan a big round of applause. Okay, right, who else can we get to do it? You're right, love. Yeah, you did your hero. Okay. <laughs> who can I get now? You see, they've gone, that one, the same time people, they've gone. Now. Right, you can do it now, sir. We'll use you. Right, can we do it, yeah? If you don't mind. What's your name? Andy. Andy. We've got Andy. Give Andy a big round of applause. Okay, Andy. Oh, he's going for it. Glasses off. Glasses off. It's a hero. Right, ladies and gentlemen, give a big round of applause for Alan. Andy. Uh, Andy. That's Alan. Right, just hang on. Hang on, walking. Give him a clap as he walks in. One, two, three. I think that's more Liam Gallagher, to be fair. <laughs> Give him a big round of applause. Right, now what we're going to do is, I think the best one is going to be Michael. You can do the hero, can't you? Can you do that? Get some sweets and all that if you do it. Who was the best then, Alan or Peter? The first one or the second one? Let's have a, let's have a, right, if you think it was Alan, give us a round of applause. Sit down, Alan, sit down. <laughs> if you thought it was Andy, give us a round of applause. 
Yeah, well, that's that decided. <laughs> so, will you do the presentations, please, Michael? Will you give out the prizes to Alan? Come here, then. Come here, son. Alan, no expense spared, my friend. From Candy Crush. Oh, yes, my friend. You've won. <laughs> Don't get too excited, Alan. You've won a bag of candy floss. There you go. And you've also won two tickets to the Frog and Bucket as well. Give me a round of applause. We'll sort you out two tickets to the Frog and Bucket. And then, where's Andy? I'll tell you what. Alan. Alan, give that candy floss to Andy. This is much better. Give him that candy floss. No, give it Alan. Give it Andy. Andy wins the candy floss. Let's have a round of applause for Andy. And now, no expense spared from <laughs> Bolton Council. <laughs> We've got the best of the bunch bag. Listen, folks, we're living the dream here, aren't we? I've no idea what's inside. But I'm getting more excited as a lucky in Alan. Not just one bag. <laughs> We've got the Northwest finest, the Northwest finest food market bag. I think it's got a zip on it, Alan. <laughs> it's got a zip on it. Hold that, Michael. Don't go there yet. Just one sec. I think there's something else in here. Not just a bag, Alan. <laughs> We've only got a flipping tea towel. <laughs> Look at that, a tea towel. This is like the generation game now, isn't it? You've got that. Oh, something else as well, Mike. Something else. A lemon. Oh. Not just any lemon, Alan. It's a soft, squeezy lemon. It's not a real one. Rubber. Hold that, Michael. You're doing well here, son. Car stickers. <laughs> Car stickers. Can you believe it, Alan? Alan, I wish you pretend that you were the best prize in the world. Alan, you've won car stickers. <laughs> There's a car stick. We're not finished, Alan. We're not finished. You've won. Fridge magnet. A shopping list. Fridge magnet. You're living the dream now, Al. You'll never have to forget. You'll never have to forget anything again before you go shopping. So let's all put it in the black bag here for him. Here we go. He's got two tickets. You can both have two tickets for the from the bucket, and I'll sort them out. I'll give an email, Jeff. You've got to come down, Andy. Okay. Yep. I'll give him a couple of tickets. You and him. Put them all right. So you put them all back in there, please, Michael. And then we'll do a big present. Stand up, please, Alan, because Michael's going to present you with the prize. Big round of applause for Alan, please. Come on, let's hear it for Alan. Oh, look at that. Alan. Oh, brilliant. Look. From now on, his nickname is Baghead. And now the special prize goes to my little superstar here. Let's hear it for Michael. Well done, Michael. Thanks a lot, mate. Now, listen, I'm going to finish off. I can't play the piano, but I'm going to give it a go. You might not enjoy it. It might be a bit less Dawson, but... That's showbiz, isn't it? <laughs> All right, so thanks again. Uh, we're going to go around this. Um, that lady at the back there, see her waving there? She's a, that, not that lady, but I can wave anyway, darling. Hello. You see where it said, you see freshly made milkshakes? I don't know her, she's just some nutter. <laughs> but you know the coffee grind over there? That lady there with the, uh, the bucket, see that bucket? If you could throw a bit of shrapnel in there, that'd be nice. And uh, my lads, where's my lads? There's Josh over there, and he's got some. And um, just throw a few quid if you can, or whatever you can afford. If you can't afford anything, don't worry about it. There's some cards where you can make a donation to Comic Relief. And other than that, thank you very much. I'm going to go play the piano for a bit while you enjoy your food. Thank you. And we'll see you soon. All right. All right, Michael. Thanks, pal. Here we go. Play a bit of piano. I'm going to sing a song about Alan, the winner. Alan, this is just for you, pal.
Alan, can you hear me? Hey up, hey up. What she wants to tell me something, go on. I used to be a singer at Duke Clubs. Can I not give you song? What backing track have you got? I, I, I'll be able to play the piano for you. What, what, do, you want to, what do you want to sing? After, after. Let me have my drink. No, let's do it now. Uh, While the camera's here. What's your name? Lillian. Miriam? Miriam? Lillian. Lillian's going to sing us a song, everybody. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Put your bag down there so nobody mix it. You don't like these young lads. I'm going to play it for you on the piano. What are you going to sing? Um, do you know um, Shirley Bassey? Shirley Bassey? Uh, um, hey, Big Spender? Uh, no, uh, it's, um, wait a minute, it's the limousine. Uh, no, no, uh, I will love you as I love you all my life. You don't know that. Yeah, you will, mate, I'll play it. Oh, right, hang on. Right, stand there and do it. You do it and I'll catch up with you. I'll, I'll play along. Okay? Go, let's go. Two minutes. Two minutes. Go on. Go on. Oh, I, wait a minute. I will love you. As I've loved you all my life. Every moment spent with you makes me more content with you. Just as you are, you are all I could pray for. Just as you are, that's what I'd wake up each day for. Every single touch. He wants to thank you for singing the song. Are you sexy? Are you sexy? <laughs> <laughs> Let's get a photo. Get a photo. Hey, hey, Hang on, here's her husband. He's jealous now. Look. Play music. We can get. Yeah, oh, we're gonna play. Play some music. Okay. All right. All right. We haven't got any music, but I can play some. <laughs> We've got one minute to go. Are you ready? Let's hear it for the new couple. Thanks a lot, everybody. Get, throw some money in the pot for uh, comedy relief, please. And we'll see you soon. Thank you very much. Hey. That's great. This is great. I'm back. I'm back. How old are you? 79 in June. Give her a big round of applause. That was the best one so far. <laughs> that was Gig 10, Bolton uh, Food Market. And she made my day. Big Al. And uh, what was she called? What's she called? Uh, Lillian or something? Anyway, Lillian. She was, yeah. Lillian. 
Fantastic. So thanks a lot, Bottle. We've got to do another one in Bottle now, so I'll see you in a bit. See you in a bit.